you've watched them eat, now find out what your favorite Academy stars nosh on and where the food comes from. The Academy's African penguins are one of our star attractions. Funny, social, a little stinky. But did you also know that penguins are finicky eaters? They eat herring here at the Academy, but no outwardly ugly fish. We usually save the best looking of the herring for the, for the penguins because they're looking for things that look healthy. Penguins like to eat fish that are whole without missing eyeballs or fins or an open mouth. Um, any abnormalities in the fish and the penguin will probably drop it to the bottom of the tank. But don't judge the penguins. They have a good excuse for their pickiness. The penguins actually have bristles on their tongues that use a, kind of like a hook. They face backwards so that as the fish gets thrown to the back of their throat, they actually catch on those hooks and can't come back out. But whenever they have an abnormality in the mouth or the gill, it's a lot harder to get the fish to go down smoothly. Makes sense now, doesn't it? And ugly herring don't go to waste. We'll save that for the red-tailed catfish in the flooded forest or uh, for some of the, the alligator gar, anyone that really doesn't mind eating an ugly fish. The food preparation team is picky too, but for very different reasons. Most of our herring comes from either Alaska or Vancouver, both from sustainable populations. Uh, they catch less than 20% of the projected amount of mature herring that will be there. If we can source a food item from a sustainable source that we know is sustainable, it is the best practice. That goes for the produce that our animals eat too. We feed the animals organic foods because it, it better ensures that we're clearing any potential pesticide residue and that they're getting the most nutritious diet. Speaking of nutritious, broccoli enjoys popularity with several animal species. In addition to uh, some of our herps who will have diced broccoli in their diet, we also feed it out to the birds, um, as well as to some of the fish in the Philippine coral reef. Fish that eat broccoli? Typically, a lot of the grazer fish in the Philippine coral reef are looking for things to nibble on throughout the day. And so one of the reasons we have broccoli in the Philippine coral reef is uh, to prevent them from nibbling on the corals that are in the exhibit. So it sort of distracts them from that activity because we want to maintain our corals as best we can. You knew there had to be a good reason. The Academy's food prep staff are celebrity chefs in their own right, or the Academy's animal celebrities and they love their jobs. The very first time that I came into the Academy was uh, in 2008 after they opened a new building and I walked in and I, I thought if I could work here that would be awesome so I'll see what I can do and here I am.